What a beautiful day outside. Hmm. What day is it? Sunday? I guess I'll go to church. We're out here at Cascade Hills Church and actually just outside the prayer garden. Uh, interesting, interesting thing about the prayer garden is when our, uh, our main pastor, uh, Pastor Bill Purvis, um, prayed to God for salvation and his, uh, and his uh, helping through his life. He was at a troubled time in his life. And one of the things that he did was he, was he prayed to God and he was uh, actually bleeding in a parking lot of, uh, of uh, uh, an old theater here in town. That's, that's called Three Arts Theater. And there was a light pole. This light pole was actually there that he prayed against. And so when they were about to close down uh, that, uh, that, sh that, that movie theater or Cascade Hill, or Cascade Hills, I'm gonna get this out in a minute. Put this on my blooper reel. The point is, when they were about to uh, shut it down or renovate the uh, the area, what they did was they, they asked him because they knew the pastor always came there every year, on the same day every year, no matter where he was at, he would come back to that particular spot and he would pray against that light pole. So he they asked him if they wanted it. So he, did, he definitely came down and got it. He made a prayer garden out of it. On the other side of these bushes are a place to sit and, and pray. So you always have a, have that. But that's just one thing that's interesting here at Cascade Hills Church. So let's go on inside and I'll show you around a little bit. But we're just trying to live the coolest life. Well, one of the other areas here that they have at Cascade Hills is the uh, Cascade Kids. It's a recreation room that they have up here. Uh, sometimes they'll rent it out, and sometimes they, they just have it here for services. I'm actually between services now, but it's a you can see there's a air hockey and pool and and. Uh, Foosball, basketball at the end. Downstairs is a, uh, a jungle gym for kids. Uh, they do a good job keeping it clean for the children, so it's a, a very nice uh, setup that they have here. Uh, so that way, when you bring your kids here, they don't have to go. They don't have to go to the um, uh, service itself, so you don't hear the crying kids because they've got a full nursery that's staffed uh, by not only uh, professionals but also volunteers that work downstairs in the nursery. Let's go see what else we can find. Now this room is the theater. When I said theater, there's about 60 seats here that they can show movies and, and have different uh, get-togethers. There's also a thing called life groups here at Cascade Hills. Life groups is uh, you get together with a group of, say, 8 to 12 people, and you do life together. So maybe, you're, maybe you're foodies, so you get out and you go out to eat at different places. Uh, other people are horseback riding or into ATVs or golf, uh, basketball, different things. Some people are into movies, so they may come here and put a movie in and, and watch the movie uh, and just really spend some time together. So that's one of the other facilities they have here at Cascade Hills. So what you just saw was down here at this hallway. But down here at this hallway, there are separate classrooms that do for Sunday school service. Give you an idea what some of those look like. Different classes they have. They got a huge list of classes. Some are for beginners. Some are going through different books of the Bible. Um, just depends on the time of the year. They've also got a marriage retreat going on, which is it's called a marriage getaway now, not a marriage retreat, uh, down in um, Orlando, and they're doing it at one of the Disney parks. Yes, they're doing it without kids. They do have a chance to uh, go experience the park as a couple because this is about the, the husband and a wife coming together as one. So it uh, uh, definitely encourages um, uh, getting together. And uh, the, the life groups are a lot of what we call the small groups also. You can see that there. Cascade U, Cascade University. Tells you about a lot of different uh, uh, goings on here at the church and, and what happens. But uh, you can see they've got a middle school and a high school areas down at that end. They let you out because the doors, didn't, the locks didn't work. And, and so we were... We were poor. I want you to understand. We were so poor, the poor people called us poor, okay? And, and, and it was just not where we had kids to meet. And, and I, I don't know why, but I knew that God, I knew that God saved my soul. I knew the Bible talked about God could forgive my sins. I knew it talked about that he could take me to heaven. I believed that. I believed that I was forgiven. I could go to heaven. I had a peace in my heart about that. As I read the Bible, I saw that God talked about um, things like parenting and marriage and even business and how you treat people. And, that, and the Bible spoke about every subject. 
But I didn't know that God said anything about money or finances. I just kind of thought, that's kind of a secular thing over here that God don't care about. It's over there. And that's for me to take care of that. But everything else in my life came under a spiritual heading where God was in charge. So that was a, that's a Cascade Hills Church. Um, always have a good time here. Uh, have, they have four services going on. Of course, we're in the middle of pandemic, so we've got our little uh, mass with us. And they encourage that. And they got uh, hand washing stations throughout the building and, and they make sure they do that. They also do social distancing within seating. So it's a, uh, they do a really good job of that. But, uh, but if you're need a church, I highly recommend this church here because we attend here all the time, don't we? Yes, we do. Yes, we do. We've also got a prayer partners ministry, uh, which is what Children's this ministry. one here is all about for our prayer partners. Uh, people that signed for our prayer partners uh, got a mug today, so it's a way of saying thank you. Now, this area here is the uh, baptismal. It's outdoors. It was actually designed by the same people that make the ones for um, Bass Pro Shops. So they did a really good job. The pool there in the middle that you see, I say in the middle, I guess it's in the middle, is actually heated. So they'll do baptismals, uh, baptisms here every day of the week. It just depends on whenever, whatever's a good time for you. So, uh, uh, and they definitely use it. Uh, I think we, even through pandemic, we had uh, like 280, I think it was, this past year. So uh, definitely, uh, we believe in baptism. This is a Baptist church. Uh, but uh, come on out and enjoy uh, uh, Cascade Hills Church. If you're ever in Columbus, Georgia, passing through, got a huge children's ministry too, as I showed you before. So uh, uh, come on, enjoy. Be sure to like and subscribe to this video and hit that little bell so you see our new videos that are coming out. Because we're just out here trying to live the coolest life.